guys, my name is Savannah. I'm the marketing director here at Purple Pass Ticketing, and today I'm going to show you three simple tricks on Photoshop that you can use to turn those event posters, flyers, images from being dull to something amazing. So first you're going to want to find that image and pull it up in Photoshop. Once it's up, the first tool I like to use and play with is the brightness contrast tool, and you'll find that in your layers and under the toolboard. Once that's selected, a panel should show up and it should have an adjuster for brightness and contrast. From there, you can kind of play with it and see what it does, but it really takes a dull image and brings it to life. Adjusting both elements can really transform your image in a positive and a negative way, as you can see if I pushed it all the way back and made it a lot more flat in contrast. So I would just play with it and find what makes your image the best quality that you want. The next tool I use is the levels tool, and this is my favorite. Basically what the Levels tool is doing is adjusting your photo's highlights and shadows. So as you can see, adjusting those three top arrows will drastically affect your image. So again, I would recommend playing with this, pushing it around until you get it to where you want it to be. If you want a little less shadow or a little less highlight, the bottom two arrows is where you can adjust that and push it more into the center. And finally, to top it off, if you need those posters or flyers to really pop and catch someone's eye, I would recommend using the Hue Saturation tool. So clicking on that, you can see there's a few different options you can use. I usually just use the saturation and adjust it a few points. Really, a few points is all you need. Sometimes people get a little saturation crazy and push it all the way up, making it look super fake, super cheesy. I don't do that. I just like pushing it up a few points here and there. And just doing that, you can see it really makes a difference with your image. And that's it, how you can turn your image from dull to amazing in just three steps. It's that easy.